Shi Ishigaki House. Hi, Sai! Hi, Sai! Welcome to Tours Around Okinawan Cultural Site! We will be introducing to you a variety of Okinawan culture. And today we have come to Ryukyu Mura in Onna Village. Ryukyu Mura has a theme of Okinawan culture and nature. This place opened in the year 1982. A lot of tourists have visited to this place. The size is 95,000 square meters. You can enjoy the Okinawan old lifestyle and village. We are going to visit an old Okinawan house that was selected and registered as a national cultural property in Yukimura. Okay, let's go! Nikki and Crystal's tours around Okinawan cultural sites! Nikki, what is this? This is the rope for Naha Tug of War. This is huge. It's very big and high, huge. Wow. <laughs> it's taller than you. Yes, it is. And this is also registered in the Guinness Book of World Record Ooh. as the biggest rope. In the world? Yes, in the world. Wow. Yes. The origin of Naha Tug of War is said to be around 1450 AD. The 1995 Guinness Book of Records says it's the world's largest rope. It has been certified and has continued to break records. The overall length is 186 meters and it weighs over 40 tons. The diameter of the rope is 1.58 meters with 15,000 pullers and 275,000 participants and is truly the biggest in the world. I would love to attend the tug of war someday. Yes, a lot of tourists enjoy this event. We should go together. Okay. Let's go. All right. And now into UQ Village. UQ Village is widely used both domestically and internationally for TV programs and movies. There are many recommended filming spots too. It seems fun to take a walk while looking for a good spot. We can also watch the Okinawan traditional dance performance called Asa. はい、さあ、あの、<笑><笑> Tours around Okinawan cultural sites. Nikki, look at this building. Mm -hmm. This is the Kami Ashagi. Many events and rituals is held in this sacred place. Let's take a look. As you can see, the roof is made low. The roof is low so that wild animals cannot enter this area. Mm. To watch uh, the stone inside, the sacred stone inside, you need to bow down. By bowing down, you naturally show respect to the sacred stone. Oh, Okinawans really thought of everything when they were building these buildings. Yes. After we left Kamiyashagi, we went to go look for old Okinawan houses. The first house we arrived at is the former Higa house. It's the former Higa family house. Oh. And look at this cute, colorful shisa. It is cute. Mm -hmm. Ah, this is the place where the NHK movie Tempest was filmed. Yes, and I want to show you the scene from Tempest. Oh, sorry, I wanted to say that, but I couldn't uh, prepare for the scene today. Why did you mention it? Hey, Crystal, wait! Wait, Crystal, wait! Wait! The former Higa family residence stores many bottles of the Okinawan alcohol, Awamori. Awamori is a liquor that matures even while still in the bottle. If you like alcohol, the staff can explain to you the best way to drink it, so please feel free to visit. And Crystal, look at this. It says, congratulations, happy wedding anniversary and kanji. Ooh. On a special day like this in Okinawa, you store a awamori in a pot, and as it ages, it tastes better. Oh, so it's kind of like the couples that get married, as time goes on, they become closer. That's right. Tours around Okinawan cultural sites. Crystal, the Higa family crafted the shisa. Oh, that's cool. Oh, and they made it in this process. Yes, this is the process. Oh, 
Lishi saw it look really cute. Yes, with a smile, with a cute smile. We are here now to visit the former Shimabukuro house. Nikki, look, mm -hmm. it's the former Shimabukuro family residence. Mm -hmm. And also look at the beautiful and simple red tile roof. There's the Shisa. Oh. Let's go inside. Yes, let's go inside. It's a traditional Okinawan style house. The series drama Sunny Girl, co-produced by China and Taiwan, was shot here. And the original owner of this house was a successful person in agriculture. This building has a really big roof. Oh, Crystal, this is not a building. It's a storehouse. A storehouse to store some food and some grains. By raising the floor, it protects the grains from the mice and the moisture. Oh, that's really clever. <laughs> Tours around Okinawan cultural sites. Nikki, what's this area for? This is the family altar. Uh, this is common in Okinawan house. And this is the cuisine for your ancestors. Mm. Okinawan rice pudding and many other foods too. Oh, cool. What's this area we've come to? This is the old Okinawan kitchen. Oh, this is the pot because it's huge. Yes, it is huge. Okinawa had a large family, so they usually use a huge pot to feed their families. Oh. Mm -hmm. and this is the Hinukan, or it's called a god of fire. Uh, in the kitchen, you usually use fire, so to show respect to the god of fire, this is the area to pray to the Hinukan. Mm. There is also the former Oshido house. Tamanaha house. Nishi Ishigaki House The Hirata House Furu And the former Kokuba House, which all can be visited at UQ Village If you visit UQ Village, you will certainly have a great time experiencing Okinawan culture.